All right, here we go. Got a lacquer thinner. Let me turn this down a little bit. I'm gonna call Norm La Tulip today. Give an update on my Corvair heads, which he's supposed to have done soon. Okay. I should be wearing gloves for this, guys. Um, but I'm not. Because I don't have any, and I'm not gonna go get some. But I should be wearing some to protect my. Actually. Hang on. I'll make you guys happy. Hang on. There. One's better than none, right? There you go. So, what I'm doing now is just going over the whole thing with some lacquer thinner. Real quick, I'm not gonna go nuts. I'm not gonna go crazy with this. I'm just gonna go over it. Kind of quick, kind of fast. This end cap here is aluminum. I'm not gonna spray paint that. I'm gonna mask that off. That way, there's at least a little bit of aluminum showing on this thing, you know? I've already washed it, and I've lightened, uh, lightened it, well, I kind of lightened it a little bit. You guys are probably like, well, how'd you light the, lighten the freaking differential transmission? Well, I took the grinder and took off some of the casting marks. There's one on the top I took off, there's one right here I took off, there's a couple on the sides. I probably took a good two pounds of iron good American steel off this cover transaxle just by taking off all the casting casting marks but hey why not it's already out this will eventually be a uh, racing transmission either this one or the one in my father's garage I haven't decided yet so basically all I'm doing now is just <coughs> I got the garage door open guys so don't worry I'm pretty well ventilated plus it's really windy out because there's a big storm coming with some rain so as far as me having something that's uh, you know a mask I, I don't need one just because it's pretty well ventilated safety first I know that we got a lot of stupid ass comments on my I mean, every, everybody's got opinions, but geez, some of these freaking stupid comments. Well, what's the point of this video? Or, or you don't know anything about race fuel. Or this dude, I'm a freaking average Joe, just like you or me. I'm not a freaking scientist. I'm not out here to freaking correct anybody or, or, or make anybody feel, feel bad or be Mr. Smarty Pants or whatever. I'm just out making videos just like Cobra Wild does and have a good time. Try, I try to be informative. If I'm wrong, that's fine. You guys can correct me. Just don't fucking... Don't fucking be a dick about it. No offense. You know, I, everybody's wrong. Can't be perfect all the all the time, right? Like right now, I'm wrong. I have to be wearing safety goggles and a mask and a respirator and this, that, and the third. I have to be wearing all this stuff and gloves because it's lack of thinner. And if you get in your bloodstream or this or that, come on, guys, really? What are you guys gonna be the freaking safety people? Ocean. OSHA, the OSHA 10 people. Anyways. So once I clean this up, I'm just going to throw a coat of primer on there. You 
still some spooge at some spots. It's okay. It must be perfect. Cause like I said, I'm just putting this on the on my Corvair motor I'm building as is. Doesn't have to be perfect. There does not have to be perfect. Um, besides that, I already got my, my brand new seals for this. I may or may not be taking it back apart, so I just bought some seals. Just If I take it back apart, then oh well. I take it back apart. No biggie. Not a big thing. I'll take it back apart. Gotta come off the orange car anyways, because this and my motor is going in the orange car so I can bring up the Sturbridge Mass for that Corvair convention. I wonder if there's registration or if you just show. Maybe I have to register my car. Well, of course I have to register, you know, with DMV. I'm talking about registering it for the show. Well, I'm going to be making so many videos. So many videos, like Corvair Wild. <clears throat> I'm not taking too much uh, grease and rust and everything else off this, which we did a good job power uh, washing it down, power washing it. Yeah, taking brake clean of the whole thing, pretty much. Um. But the Corvair, Corvair is pretty much all done. The orange thing is pretty much all done. All I got, to, all I got to do is remove my motor, remove that, remove that motor, and I will be selling that 110 three-speed. So if anybody wants it, it is a running 110 three-speed, and I have driven it. It's a running motor. It needs a little bit of work, like uh, tune-up parts and the O-ring and the push-around tubes have to be replaced because it leaks like a sieve. It, it runs it runs great it does I haven't opened up the motor so I don't know what the inside of it looks like no idea I know the transmission shifts really well there's no doesn't seem like there's any play or any any bad noises coming from the differential the transmission they then again go yeah, yeah, yeah don't count me on it because uh, as people know, buyer beware, you never know what you're getting. I haven't been through the transmission differential. I don't know what it looks like on the inside. I know what this one looks like on the inside. It's freaking mint. That's why I'm putting it in the car as is. I wish this was an all aluminum transmission, but it's not. Oh well. Can't have your cake and eat it too, I guess. I've taped off everything in the front here. I'm not taping on bolt holes, I don't need to. Don't need to tape off bolt holes, sorry. Uh, not necessary. Eventually, this case, the differential case, and the, transact and the transmission case, they're all going to get powder coated. Eventually, in the long run, they're all Go get powder coat. Uh, 
My mower caught on that. Hold on, buddy. I'm getting my shrouds powder coated for my mower. I'm getting my shrouds powder coated right now, actually. It's going to be a nice metallic blue. Very close to what my Corvair is going to get painted. Not going to be perfect. But it'll be close. I'm going to have to uh, take the blowgun to this motor. Get all the fuzzies off. Why am I wasting paper towels? Oh, guys, why didn't you tell me about this before? I have these nice... rags here. Oh yeah. This looks so much better. Why didn't you tell me about this before? I'm like halfway done. Not perfectly clean yet. Alright. I think that's good enough. Pretty clean now. I'm just going to uh, tape off that aluminum end cover and spray painter. We'll get her done. See you in a bit.